It is so emotional. It's it's so tough. It's hardship after hardship for High Point couple Bobby and Brent Tucker, now left without a home after becoming victims of a rental scam. This just seems like something after something after something. Times were already tough when they opened their nutrition store in September during the pandemic. Then their daughters tested positive with COVID-19. Then we had to shut down for a while just to make sure we didn't have it. Well, that threw us further behind with bills. The couple got evicted. They applied for assistance, then searched online for a new place to live, coming across an ad on Craigslist. A house um, in High Point on Shilton Way. I text the guy. Someone was responding um, about the property. I just said that I was interested. The couple arranged to see the property, but the person on the other end of the phone said they weren't available, but told them to head to the home anyway. I let him know we were there. Well, then um, he said, I left, the, I, I left the door unlocked for you. I left the door unlocked to go ahead and go in. The couple saw the home alone. They fell in love with it. The person who posted the listing said they needed to pay an $800 deposit to secure the place as it was in high demand. They paid, but no keys came. I sent him a message and I said, this is very serious. If we don't have this home as of Sunday, my family will be without a home. The two filed fraud claims and reported it to the police, but are still out $800 and without a home. We just don't want this to happen to somebody else and to be in a house stable for Christmas without mold and heat and um, it just to have your dreams crushed and it just to feel like that somebody could do that. The Tuckers are now staying in a hotel. Family is helping pay for the stay while they look for a place to live.